A grieving Monroe man has made it his mission to turn the tragic loss of his cousin into action when it comes to violence toward children. Sean Lawson wants to do more than just memorial, not memorialize Nevea Buchanan, who would have turned six yesterday. Fox Toledo's Chrissy Lee is live in the newsroom with what he is doing. Well, Lawson wants to take his cause to Washington. His cousin, Nevea, was taken from her apartment complex in Monroe, Michigan, last May and later found dead along the River Raisin. He still can't believe someone would commit such a senseless crime, but he's determined to help prevent that heartache from happening to other families. We're always talking about terrorists, you know, the terrorists terrorizing the country. What about the terrorists that are terrorizing our children today? You know, the, the kids that don't even have a chance, you see it on TV all the time. So Nevaeh's cousin is single-handedly trying to improve safety in his community and far beyond by fighting for tougher laws, enforcement, and more community involvement. I think we need better surveillance. I think we better, need better neighborhood watches. Um, we need uh, um, more police, you know, more police out there. We need stricter laws. Um, the state legislators, they need to stand up and they need to do something. Lawson says when he's not working to pay his bills and hold his family together, he's on the phone calling legislators, state reps, national media outlets, and trying to organize neighborhood watches. And he says he's doing it all in this little angel's name. I'm not doing it for me. I'm not doing it for my family. I'm not just so because I want to be on TV or nothing like that. It's not about that. It's about Nevaeh. You know, it's about her. Lawson admits it hasn't been easy taking all this on alone. He says you're welcome to join the fight. To help Lawson make phone calls or organize a group, visit our website, foxtoledo.com. We'll help you get in contact with him. Reporting live, Christy Lee, Fox Toledo News.